morning and I've lucked out. It looks like there is a 5K run today in the city and it looks like everybody in Den Haag is out for it. Uh, I'm going to go check it out because it looks like a lot of fun. You can see all of the people who are headed to the start line. As you can probably tell by my umbrella, it's a little bit rainy here today. Uh, not too bad, just misty mostly. In Atlanta, we get thousands and thousands of people that come out for races, but they're usually marathons and half marathons. This is just a 5K and it looks like half the city is here. The great thing about this is that the race starts at 9.30. Uh, in places like Atlanta, races like this start at 7 o'clock in the morning because any time after that it gets way too hot to run. So it's one of the benefits, I guess, of living here is that you can start these things a little later. So this actually looks like it's a run for kids. Almost everybody that I'm seeing has a child with them. So, uh, but I've never seen anything like this. This is huge. It's like there are literally thousands and thousands of people here. And we're only at wave one starting and it's just crazy. And it's pouring rain and everybody still comes out for it. You know, the Dutch are some of the fittest people in the world, at least as far as I can see. Uh, it's because they do things like this. They don't care about the weather. Um, they ride their bikes everywhere and, uh, and walk everywhere. So this is probably shouldn't be surprising that I'm seeing this many people out for something like this. Well, it looks like the rain has let up a bit today, so that's good. Um, I'm going to head over to the Mauritius Museum. That's where you'll see the girl with the pearl earring, probably the most famous Vermeer painting. And I hear that the museum is good other than that as well, so I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, we're going to start walking now and uh, get over there. It's about a 10 minute walk, and I prefer walking to the trams. But since it's going to be a rainy day in The Hague, that means it's also going to be an indoor museum day. So I'm gonna make sure everybody eats. I got bills. I got to pay. So I'm gonna work, work, work. It's actually kind of peaceful when it's raining out because there's no one in the streets, so it makes it really nice and calm. I'm walking down this street right now and there's absolutely nobody. Nobody at all on the streets. So it's a nice peaceful walk. Hopefully it doesn't start raining. Uh, but this is a nice little area. Nothing's open, of course, because it's Sunday. Uh, everything is closed. Except the museums. I hope.
everybody comes to see the girl with the pearl earring is actually not on display right now. But if you can see right behind me, they are doing some x-ray work on her. What they're doing is they are scanning her for lead content, at least that's what I've been led to believe. Uh, apparently there's a lot of lead in the pearl earring itself, so they're doing some work on that and there are people here from all over the world studying the painting. The painting will go back on display tomorrow. Uh, I'm not too disappointed because this is actually pretty cool to see and I've seen this painting before when she was at the High Museum of Art in Atlanta. So this is just another aspect of the art that's, uh, that's really neat. Uh, I was asking the people inside how people felt about the girl with the pearl earring being off display and they said a few people were disappointed and I can understand why. I've seen her before but I gotta tell you it was probably one of the coolest things I've seen. I've never seen them doing something like that to a painting before. They were taking x-rays and figuring out uh, the composition for better preservation. So for me it was worth the visit just to see that. been walking around Den Haag looking for something to eat. So I walked down this street thinking it was full of restaurants and it turns out it's all prostitutes. I had something more tasty in mind. Just after I shot that last video in the prostitute area I got stopped by a police officer for doing it. She thought I was taking pictures of the girls but I was really only taking a video so she understood. These buildings are all standing in mud. The Dutch must have some of the best engineers in the world because these buildings will be sinking anywhere else. I'm on my way home from a night out in Den Haag and I decided to pick up some Indonesian food. And I've never heard of this before, but I got something called Nasi Rames, R-A-M-E-S. And it actually looks quite delicious. So this is my little nightcap on the way home from a night out. painting of the girl with the pearl earring is not on display right now and the reason for that is is they have it in here in here and they are